Hello beautiful people, I'm Polly from Charming Tavi and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how I'm going to make small Christmas charms as a gift for my family. Um, actually those charms uh, have various purposes, you can use them in different craft projects if you'd like. Uh, for example, you can use them in junk journals. I'm using um, such charms in uh, the junk journals that I'm making sometimes. So they are very beautiful and small and very, very easy to make. This is the most important thing. Um, these Christmas charms are vintage because uh, I used vintage beads as you see and those beautiful metal pendant so let's get started okay um, I am going to use just to remove this one from the side uh, those beads blue and uh, white bead and I'm going to use uh, let me just fix my camera okay um, this beautiful Santa Claus and this Christmas tree for those charms that I'm going to use. They are the straps for cell phone charms. And two beautiful beads. I like those beads actually. They look very, very beautiful. Okay, and of course, those two wires for jewelry. Uh, where are. Ah, okay. There is the wire that I use, uh, but I cut. Let me see how much. Mm, about. 8.5 centimeters uh, which is let me convert them in inches uh, let me see 8 8.5 okay 2 inches this is 3.3 inches um, so they are small pieces of um, the wires. I don't need bigger one. Um, and I'm going to use... Okay, let's get started. Uh, this wire that I'm using is very thick. I think it was uh, four millimeters, uh, if I'm not lying, of course. So uh, sometimes it's very difficult to bend it you have to use a lot of pressure a lot yes like this it's not perfect but after all it's handmade uh, let me put the bead okay here it is and this one okay 
um, as I said, is those terms are not something special. They're not difficult to use. I mean, not to use, I mean to make. But uh, depends on the wire that you're going to use. You, of course, if the wire is like mine, you should uh, press it harder. Okay. So if there are pieces um, from the sides, I don't know, can, I hope you can see it. You should cut them because they're unpleasant, <laughs> very, very unpleasant, and uh, you can hurt someone with them. Uh, sometimes I cut myself on them which is horrible. Um, next. Let me just move those two. Um, and uh, sometimes when I'm trying to open them, then you they open and they broke. So I'm always careful how I'm using. Okay, where it is? Aha. Uh -huh. running yeah huh? don't want to close okay oh it's very beautiful oh how many ah okay two Very easy to do. Ah, just like this. I show you. <laughs> After this, I can't use it again. So I'm I'm careful how to open them. Not so difficult to make them. But after you make them, they look very beautiful. Just like this one. And I'm going to make the last one.
this is the last one um okay The beat just remove those. Okay, then from this part. like how it's moving I think I open it too much, but we'll see. Okay. Apparently you 
can you use such open one so wide? There it is. Uh, I don't think that it's closed very well. Here and the last one. That it's not closed very well too. I'm gonna fix it. Oops. I hope it's better like this. Okay. So those are the terms. I don't know how much time it took um, and I'm going to put them in those little boxes um, they are from my Etsy shop I designed them this is one little sweet mouse. You can use them for uh, candies, any kind of Christmas treats that are wrapped or as me, you can use them in um, those with those charms actually I'm going to use them with those charms and I'm going to put these tags so if you like those boxes they're in my Etsy shop I have Halloween boxes um, I have to go and show it to you just to take it which is over there um, there, there it is. I dropped my microphone. Those are the Halloween boxes. Box, not boxes. I'm sorry. Um, they are available in my Etsy shop if you like those beautiful boxes so this is from me for today thank you for watching and I wish you amazing day bye bye